We've created a problem so massive, so overwhelming, that we're running out of places to hide it. Humanity's trash output is relentless, turning oceans into soup and landscapes into wastelands. What would it take to make this nightmare disappear? What if we could just burn it all up? The idea has been tossed around, debated by scientists and environmentalists alike. And let's face it, there's something almost mythical about throwing our garbage into an active volcano, as if nature itself would obliterate our problems in an instant. Volcanoes reach extreme temperatures, but they're not incinerators. Many materials don't just vanish when they hit lava. Plastics, for example, release toxic gases. Metals would sink and settle, and certain chemicals could lead to dangerous reactions. You're not solving a problem, you're creating a whole new one. And let's talk about those gases. Imagine the chemicals in everyday waste, plastics, electronics, and even food waste, turning into clouds of toxic fumes. Sulfur dioxide, carbon monoxide, and other deadly compounds would billow out of the volcano, creating a poison that could spread for miles. Is this truly a fix, or are we trading one environmental disaster for another? Dumping trash into a volcano would create more than just environmental havoc. It could directly impact human health. Entire communities downwind could be forced to breathe in poisonous gases, and the natural balance of entire ecosystems would be thrown off kilter. We cannot just hide our waste in nature's fury. This is about respect for ourselves, for our communities, and for the Earth. Instead of using nature to destroy our garbage, we should be thinking about how to prevent it in the first place. And then there's the raw power of these volcanoes themselves. For all our hubris, for all our belief that we can just toss our problems into a fiery abyss, we cannot ignore the simple fact. Volcanoes are unpredictable and untamable. Many are dormant, sleeping giants that could be triggered by changes in pressure or weight. Imagine what would happen if our waste dumping somehow woke one of these giants. A single eruption could spew debris, molten lava, and ash miles into the atmosphere. And if it happened near a populated area, the devastation would be unimaginable. We live here because it's our home. But the idea of triggering an eruption for convenience, it's madness. This is where we live. This is where our children play. Our lives would be destroyed. Here's a thought. What if, instead of relying on destructive forces, we invested in truly sustainable solutions? Recycling plants, waste to energy facilities, and innovations in biodegradable materials. What if we reimagined our waste as a resource instead of a burden? The truth is, there's no magical fix, and that's a hard pill to swallow. We want to believe that we can just make our waste disappear. But instead of hiding our trash, we need to confront our habits head on. We need to reduce, reuse, rethink. If we could channel even half the energy we've put into finding ways to dispose of trash into finding ways to avoid making it, we could reshape our future. Clean beaches, unpolluted air, thriving ecosystems, it's all within our reach, but only if we choose to protect what we have. So, the next time someone suggests we throw our trash into a volcano, remember, nature is powerful, but so are we. Powerful enough to create a cleaner, healthier world. We don't need volcanoes to burn away our problems. We need a change of heart, a change of habits. The choice is clear. It's time to stop looking for quick fixes and start working towards lasting change. The Earth has given us so much. It's time we give something back.